Welcome back to the EPLP, where we put the ack in ROM hack. Right here, and let's play some fucking video games. So my level is going to be Monty Mole Hall. And from looks things, there's going to be fucking moles everywhere. Which should be very, very fun to deal with. I'm getting a little bit sick of these fucking moles. Although, I suppose they need a little bit of time to shine. After all, they were almost criminally underused in the original game. You're probably noticing that the fireballs are going all over the place if you didn't actually bother to read that little bit of text. Uh, from looks things, the gimmick here is that if you throw fireballs into the staircase, they teleport off screen. However, the downside of this is that these escalators are a real fucking bastard and will push you off shit. The bottom end right here, that little fucking thing that's spinning, that doesn't actually push you anywhere, so it doesn't look like it'll push you into a pit, which is nice. Always good feature right there. So there's not too much to worry about on that end. However, we still have to deal with being pushed around a lot, as well as these fairly narrow corridors which are again making an appearance in one of my levels. I'm guessing there's a conspiracy right now. Any minute now we're going to see a fucking paladin thread. You know, the fucking Illuminati stole my teeth and they're making Ray play fucking narrow corridor levels. You know, Twitch Huey will one up him by saying something along the lines of the Illuminati stole my brain and now they're fucking making Ray play fucking mole filled levels. You know, these moles are fucking everywhere. It's like... <sighs> Damn it. I haven't seen moles this fucking frequently since Jace left EP. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to work in those efforts. Because we all know And I have to fucking do that shit. I promised after all. And Eldor is a sexy, sexy beast. Fuck you. God damn it. <laughs> These slopes combined with the escalators are just a really weird place to move. Well, that's one way to deal with them. <laughs> Let's see. As he saw the vacancy, his questions became more confident, his doubts more valid, he possessed direction again. Okay. Uh. Looks like we're continuing the whole bizarre storyline thing. I'm really wondering what the fuck is gonna, like, happen at the end. Oh, look. It's a glitch. Or is it a feature? That's the eternal question. Is it a glitch or is it a feature when the game bugs up? Writers tend to cover their asses by claiming the former. Or latter. Whereas players tend to point out bullshit, it's the former. It's a fucking glitch. Then they're all like, no, 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 it's feature. It's feature, man. Yeah, I. I'm really fucking messed up and horrible at trying to impersonate anybody. So, you know, fucking cut me some goddamn slack all of a sudden. It's been one of those days, people. You know those types. Those kind of days where it's a fucking miracle that you get through it without killing someone. Yep, that's the kind of day I've had. How was your day? Was your day pleasant? I'm guessing it wasn't. If it was, I may have to kill you. Nothing personal, but I may have to kill you. God damn. This guy's love of narrow corridors is almost as fucking scary and ridiculous as Crusher's love of Metal Gear. And 
you know, his gigantic man crush on Snake. And of course we have some sprung thwomps. Little midget thwomps. <laughs> Fuck. When will I learn to spin jump? <laughs> it's not like he hasn't been using that. Looks like the uh, feature is over. And we're back to normal gameplay. Where the staircases do exactly what they're supposed to. Oh, yeah. And now we have to dodge fireballs too. Because it wasn't bad enough before. Oh no. Now we have to jump between fireballs and platforms. So I'm just going to do exactly what you should do and exploit the whole shit doesn't draw off screen thing. To make it a hell of a lot easier on yourself. Fuck you, I'm using invincibility. Must get all coins. Fuck. Damn moles. Mole. Mole. Fucking mole. Damn right, you fucking mole. Yeah, this one here looks like he'd be a real bastard if shit lined up a certain way. Those things only start breathing fire if you get within a certain range of them. Presumably because of the uh, Nintendo's bizarre off-screen drawing thing. Because, you know, that was Sega's whole deal back in the day. Because, among other things, they were all about the whole we could draw shit like extremely far off screen so let's make a character that fucking runs like a motherfucker that was sort of their gimmick cause they do what Nintendo don't fuck god damn and looks like now we have to deal with the jumping bastards these giant statues seem to be like a fucking reference to the first game this was like the version of Bowser that showed up there he do nothing but like shoot fireballs for the most part and I think there were like a couple castles where he'd jump around a little bit although I'm a bit unsure about the second part because usually the second you got anywhere near him I'd just give him face full fireballs or jump over his back and grab that old key yeah um, some people are a little bit surprised that you can actually take him out with fireballs it's true you can <laughs> he's worth a lot of points that way as well so for those of you that actually give a shit about points, you sad, sad people, that's how you get a lot of them. Take out the boss with fireballs. Although getting to them sometimes with a fire flower intact can be a little bit of a chore. I'm really hoping I can pull off a level in 10 minutes or less this time. If I do another level tonight, which I can't really guarantee because fuck today, goddamn. Yeah, I notice I've been saying goddamn a lot. I'm blaming Cory. The coarse fucking bastard. Anyway, if I wind up doing another level today, it'll probably be the uh, castle for the fire world. Because I can't get enough of these fucking castles. No, I have to be doing goddamn castle fucking castle castle fucking yeah. Plus it's the late world castle, so that's gonna make it even more fun. Oh boy. Okay, so at least you can spin jump on those. Eh, fuck you all. And it's door. And from the looks of things this is the last area. No more coins left. Uh, balls of steel. Mole. And that's the end of that shit.
fucking good too. <sighs> yep, that doesn't work out. Tension quite like an annoying bullshit fucking Mario Run hack. Nothing like it. Okay, so that brings us to World 2. Uh, uh, 3, I mean. Hey, it's been a long day. Fuck you. And I'm gonna wind up doing, like, the castle if I do anything. I'm probably really fucking close on time, if not over. So, yeah. Uh, that's it. Fuck you all. Good night. <laughs>